Not sure if you heard the news, but I just started a podcast. It's called the Donut Shop Podcast. It's pretty much everywhere. We just released it. Uh, if you guys know this backdrop, this is the usual Nick off-duty backdrop. It's kind of like my shop area. Well, guys, check out the new podcast area. Calling all units. Calling all units. Donut Shop has a fresh dozen. Go ahead and take a 1040. So I want to give you guys a quick tour of the studio space before we get started and I give you an update of what's been going on with the channel, with uh, me at work, kind of where I've been and what's coming in the future, in the near future. So this is the studio space, you got lights uh, set up uh, and then you have our camera A. We're going to have another camera right here and that's going to be pointing at whoever's sitting there and then we're going to have another camera right here, it's pointing and sitting right there, it's kind of get a frontal view of whoever's uh, talking on the podcast. Uh, if you notice the table, we made it out of cedar wood from Home Depot. Uh, myself and Officer Jay, uh, we put this thing together. It was like a little puzzle piece, bought long planks, cut them up, and this is what we came up with. Now, it needs a little touch up, not gonna lie. Underneath the table is just like a four foot uh, folding table. So we kind of rigged it up right now, but we're just like, we need to get this thing up and good enough so we can start the podcast. So we already released our first episode. Came out pretty good. I was getting good reviews. Um, you guys go check it out. I'll put all the links down in the description below where you can go check them out and subscribe to the channel. Good, so here we go. We've got our mic set up, just attached to the edge there. Uh, I know there's there's a whole bunch of ways to set up a podcast, but this is, this is what's working right now and it's working pretty good. Uh, it's hot in here, so. This is huge. I know, I'm just gonna jump to this. I know there's some decorations up there. But I'm gonna jump to this. This right here is huge, because if you remember in, in some of my earlier uh, videos inside the garage, in my studio here, it was super hot. So, luckily, you're probably hearing it now, but on the podcast, uh, you don't hear it at all. These mics cut out uh, the, the noise. It's like a noise canceling thing. So, uh, boom, this is the donut. The podcast is called the Donut Shop Podcast. So, gotta have a donut. And then, obviously, gotta have our on air little sign there, little neon sign. So, we're thinking for this space in the middle, we're gonna make the Donut Shop Podcast some kind of logo or something there. Maybe even take this, move it here, and then do like a little circle, Donut Shop, then pod underneath it. So better to look donut shop and then pod underneath it or podcast. So we're thinking, we're still working it out, but more or less this is what it is. This is my parents' old uh, kitchen cabinets that they were gonna throw away. I was like, let me get it. Spray painted it gray and then uh, turn the cabinet, the countertop upside down because the wood kind of just goes with what I got going on. So you can see the old, it's loose, but Boom, turned it upside down. Looks like wood. It does the job. I don't know if you notice, but we're just doing things that do the job for right now. Later on, we'll be a little more permanent. Up top, we got our audio recording um, device here. It's the Zoom. Uh, as recommended on YouTube, I got it. It's pretty good. We can connect up to four mics on it. The audio is crispy. So right now, we've got two mics, but Later on, as we bring guests on, they'll be sitting here, here, somebody at the head of the table. We'll bring, we'll have uh, more mics. Over here is our handy dandy black curtain. But behind the black curtain is the garage door. So the garage door, I ended up insulating with these little, uh, they're like, they come like a, a slate of drywall and they're like styrofoam made for insulation here look here's a piece right here i could take out and then you just cut it and you slide it in 
bang, you slide it in the garage doors. Helps out, helps uh, retain some of that AC. Outside, it's about 90 degrees, uh, and that's at night. So during the day, it jumps up close to 100, running 100, it's humid. So uh, this is big, however, it's still kind of hot in here from time to time. So that's why we have this fan up top. The fan's not on when we're recording, but when we're not recording, we like to turn that fan on. So a quick studio tour for you guys. Now I'm going to run down where I've been, what I've been doing, uh, why I haven't been posting lately. And after that, we're going to pick the winners for the uh, giveaway. Whoa, a little bit too bright for the giveaway that we talked about like almost two months ago. I think it was even more than that. So giveaway winner is gonna be announced at the end of this video. Uh, give me one second while I set this camera up on the table and then I'll talk to you guys about what's been going on. Hold on. Kind of taking it back to the old school days when I used to do the vlog for the police department. Uh, which by the way, uh, I'm gonna have the vlog explaining, well it's not a vlog, it's more of a video, kind of explaining what happened with that. So that's gonna be coming out very soon after this video, matter of fact, the video's it's already done. I already recorded it, it's sitting in unlisted. I just wanted to get this giveaway out of the way before I went and uh, explained everything that happened at the police department. So, if you're looking forward to that, if you're deciding, you're about to type, what happened with the, boop, time out. He's gonna release it a day or two after this video um, comes out, so look forward to that. Unless this video comes out on Friday and it's Saturday, Sunday, then I'll hold it to Monday. I like to release videos, if I can, <clears throat> midweek, because I feel like that's when everyone is on YouTube and has the best chance to get the most views. All right, all right, Nick, so uh, you're gonna release the police vlog, uh, what happened video, so we'll let you slide on that, but what else have you been doing? It's been a long time. Well, uh, I was in some riots. Matter of fact, smack dab in the middle of riots. Uh, I didn't believe that it could happen. I started to make a little vlog. Saturday, May 30th. Uh, just got a text saying that we've been mobilized at work. Um, apparently there's gonna be some protests tonight and hopefully it goes peacefully. Uh, because we have had protests, peaceful protests in the past and uh, everything went smooth. We, we like to work with protesters. We're there to hear everyone's voice and let everyone be heard. And we even at one point when they uh, began marching, uh, we kind of guided them with a convoy to make sure that nobody in the protest got hurt. So when there was word that it was something that was gonna go on in our neck of the woods, we were like, cool, we're down, we've done this before, uh, let's go ahead, let's join up with the protesters and let's help help them be heard. That's the way it normally went. Uh, showed up to work that day and uh, you guys already know the story, I'm not gonna go over it again, but it was nothing of what I expected it to be. Um, however, as the days went on, uh, things grew more peaceful and uh, you know little spark ups here and there however we were able to handle it contain things and we've been doing good uh, ever since so uh, it, but it was a good month or two solid that it was just non-stop showing up because we were on a high alert because of what happened uh, that first day so that's what I've been doing at that I've been tied up with work uh, regarding that prior uh, to this whole COVID thing going on. I was working on a project with uh, Chris from TTOG. You guys know him, he's been on the work vlog. He's been on uh, my vlog when I challenged him in a sniper. Uh, well, I don't know if it was a sniper, but I challenged him in like a shootout uh, who can draw the, the quickest and get some rounds down and uh, strike their target. Uh, he won, eh, it was close, but he won. Uh, but I, I was working on a video with him and my buddy Dave from DA1 Training and uh, Leica the Maligator's uh, handler with Leica the Maligator. Find her on uh, Instagram as well. So I was working on a project with them. COVID just started coming around. Just started getting word about it. It wasn't a thing yet, but it was like, hey, hey, we don't know, this might become a thing. So there was no social distancing. There was no mask wearing. There was no rules or, or regulations around this. So we were working on a video and that kind of got put to a halt. Now, been stuck. I want to release that video already and just be done with it um, because it ends 
And it could be an ending. It doesn't end abruptly. We filmed something at one location and the idea was to end it at another location. However, COVID really spiked up when we could, the first time that we were able to all schedule and all our schedules aligned. By that time it was too late and there was restrictions and masks and social distancing issues. So we kind of were like, let's just put this on hold until after this blows over. Three, four, almost five months later, we're still in this, doesn't look like, like it's going away anytime soon. So I'm thinking about releasing the video with a little warning. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, the warning is just to let people know so they don't flip out. Well, you guys are in social distancing. You're not wearing masks. This was filmed before all that. So let me know what you think. Uh, if you guys want to see that, uh, the video is called Operation Smooth. Uh, I'll leave it to you and your imagination of what you think it is. If you guys are down to see the video, leave a comment below uh, telling me, yeah, Nick, go ahead with the video. Release it. Release the Kraken. Or you're like, eh, I really don't care. Hold off until it's finished. And lastly, I got sick. I thought I got uh, COVID-19. I was like, man, I, I think I got it. I uh, had fevers, was tired, all that jazz. Ended up getting tested not once, but twice. Oh my God, I'm crying. Brutal, but it's good to get it done. <laughs> Woo! And uh, both times it was negative. So I was just regular sick. And lastly, the giveaway. We're gonna go ahead and start the giveaway. It's the same rules as, as always. I'm gonna go to the comments on Instagram. I'm gonna scroll through the comments, load them all up, scroll through them. And as I scroll through them, uh, I'll snap a screenshot and we'll start from the third from the top. So uh, whatever the first name is, handle, second handle, and then that third one will start with the winners. We're gonna do it a little different because we got a lot of prizes and giveaway prizes to do. So if there's a multiple of the same prize, we're just gonna include all the winners um, in that screenshot, starting from the third person. So it's a little bit different, switch it up, but it'll speed things up. So this is not like a half an hour video of us just scrolling through those giveaway winners. So I'm excited. I got that spark, that, that energy. I'm gonna be putting out tons of content. I'm excited. As soon as this video is out, look for another video. I'm also gonna be uh, dropping some topical um, snippets of the podcast, kind of like Joe Rogan clips, a uh, little, little bit like that, and then direct you over to the actual podcast channel where you guys can watch the entire thing um, in its greatness. So with that being said, let's get into the giveaway. So for this 3V gear bag, we're gonna be doing the random selection like I explained where we scroll back and forth, all the comments have been loaded. And then once we take a screenshot of the screen, then it's gonna be the third, again, one, two, three from the top for the 3V bag. Here we go. Drum roll, please. And the winner is Boom. Let's count it. Three from the top. One, two, three. Jake Creighton. Jake Creighton. Congratulations, Jake. You got yourself that awesome 3V gear bag. All right, same deal for the O light. Randomized scrolling, randomized scrolling, random scrolling, and here we go. Three from the top. Count it. One, two, three. Sal, average life. Bingo, you just won the O light. Congrats. All right, next up we have the hikes boots. Again, the hikes boots. Let's see what we got. Again, we're gonna do the same thing. Three from the top. And five, four, three, two, and scrolly, 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 bang. Who's it gonna be? Let's count it. One, two, three. De Zarios. De Zarios. Congrats on the new kicks. All right, so for the gift cards, we're just gonna start at the third from the top, and we're gonna go with the four after that. So technically it's gonna be 
uh, starting from the third from the top, then the fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh people that I screenshot are going to be the winners of the Barbells and Badges gift card. So let's do it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bang. Let's see what we got. So we'll count it. One, two, three, and the first, oh, one, two, three, here's the winner, Diggy. Diggy152, Diggy152, Dennis Pagan89, Dennis Pagan89, Tel Bahamza, Tel Bahamza, and Corey Lyon. So there you go, one, two, three, four. Four gift cards we just gave out in one shot, barbells and badges, sweet. And last but not least are gonna be the Nick Off-Duty Challenge Coins valued at $5,000 a pop. Not really, but one day maybe, who knows, here we go. There's gonna be three given away, so we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna count down to the third person and then the next three after, the next two after that third person. So it's gonna be number three, four, and five are gonna be the winners on the screenshot. So here we go, ladies and gents, Nod Squad members. The winners of these new challenge coins are... Ooh. Ooh. Here we go. Bang. One, two, three. So it's gonna be three, four, and five. I Hong. Nine, seven, nine, 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 seven, done. Baker Jacob, done. And Andrew T. Luke. Andrew T. Luke, congrats of the Nick Off Duty Coins. And that's the end of the 75K giveaway. Congratulations to all the winners. Thank you guys for participating. Um, thank you for watching the video. I had fun making that video. Um, something that I like to do, switch it up from time to time, just create a little short story or a little funny video uh, with my son, get him involved. Remember, this is Nick Off Duty, so things, I, I, can, I got more range of what I can talk about and do here. Congrats again to all the winners. I know there's some items missing. Uh, we didn't give away uh, both bags because one of those bags, uh, one of the gift cards, and two of the coins, they're gonna be given away on our Patreon. Well, I say our, uh, Nick Off Duty Patreon. You can find me on Patreon. I like to set aside some of the giveaway stuff and give it to the Nod Squad Elite members. Thank you guys for hanging in there and joining. You're still there, uh, much love. And uh, with that being said, I'll see you when I see ya. And if I don't see ya, then I'll see ya. No!